Hi friends, this is Gautam and I'm going to show you how to print the alphabet uh, ASCII values for uh, every alphabet. First, uh, we'll know what is ASCII. Uh, we'll know what is as ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information Interchange. It is a community which built, uh, which have given a unique value for every uh, symbol or character that we use. So these are the ASCII values that we use and as you can see alphabets also have values these are the values 65 is the ascii value of 60 uh, capital j capital j starts in the row so we'll uh, now we'll see how to print those values i'm using notepad and i'm going to choose the c language now now I, ha I have already written this uh, basic standard code uh, we'll jump into the code now first we'll try to print the ASCII value of a particular character sorry for that and now We'll execute this one. If you haven't seen uh, my tutorial before uh, about how to use the GCC, you can get back to that first. GCC space ASCII. Now the execution is completed and we have the output. 97 is the ASCII value for capital A. 97 is the 97 is the ASCII value of a small a. As you can see here, A's ASCII value is 97. This is what we got and we are right. Now we, we can continue with this. I will use a for loop for this and then iteration variable i is our iterator variable i starts at uh, capital A as capital A is stands first in the row i is condition will be we want to print till the last uh, alphabet so last uh, alphabet is z small z now we'll increase the iteration now this will print the ascii values of every alphabet starting from z uh, capital a to z now they just compile this and see the output for that oh sorry uh, we need to use a new line a new line character over here backslash and now we can see a perfect output so these are the ASCII values to be more clear I'll just modify this one now uh, I have added a percentile C and an I over here. So we'll see the output for this also. Yeah, now it is clear from starting A. And as you can see, the, the, the there are different symbols other than A. I mean alphabets. So we'll also <coughs> we need to uh, remove those values. that we'll use a new function called uh, is alpha this will check whether the input value is an alphabet or not and we'll keep this in if condition now it is clear if the gi given <coughs> value is alphabet then we'll print this or else it will not print it will not print so we'll save this and see the output again 
oh wow we create we got it it's clear uh, you can see there are no extra values over here now this is our program thank you for watching